All right, guys, it's your boy DeAnthony coming back at you uh, with a toy box. I haven't done a toy box opening in a while. Um, we don't really do, uh, like, toy box anymore. That's a shame. Got, got that playlist just sitting there with all the old stuff we used to open. Now we do subscription boxes, baby! No, but um, got a few things. Um, I haven't been able, I got a, a bunch of... Uh, toys I need to unbox honestly, but I don't have no scissors. So this is the only one that I can actually do uh, That does not come with scissors. So I just came across this uh, a few weeks ago. Actually probably a while ago uh, Let's see here. There we go uh, This green rager figure boy Man, so as you guys know the movie just just came out and I was a little disappointed But it still got me kind of hyped for Power Rangers So I started like looking up stuff and I found this figure here and I was like Bro, this is dope. Um, it is the Fig Arts Zero Green Ranger. So Fig Arts Zero Green Ranger. Uh, that is what it looks like. And I was super hyped for this, man. I was like, I can't believe it. Like, I don't have any other Rangers. Just the green one. Um, but it was $60. I, oh, I paid like $54 or something like that. Um, and when I got it, I was a little disappointed because I wanted it to be just a little bit, uh, bigger. Um, but let's open it up, take a look, see how easy it is to assemble and check out maybe some, uh, height specs and try to compare it to some things. So, all right, let's check it out. All right, so we got our box. Let's pop it open. We'll put the box down there. So I wanna, oh man, trust the keys, baby. So I wanted to at least show you guys, if you came across this, I didn't want you to, you know, kind of be disappointed for the price point. I need a knife, I really do need a knife. Um, because I was, you know, um, I, if you guys have noticed that Hulk I have in the back, that was 50 bucks, probably less than 50 bucks. It's way bigger than this. You know, but I know that we're probably just paying for you know, um, you know, the item that you're going to get, like, can you get another Power Rangers like this? No. So, 60 bucks. No, but I got it on Amazon, and, um, I don't know, I just had to get it, yo. Oh, man, look at that. It glows, it's like it's glowing. Uh, it doesn't really do it any justice, but it's kind of like it's, it's like it's generating its own light. It's kind of cool. I like those little cracks. Um, so this is the actual figure. He is supposed to be, uh, playing his dragon sword flute. So it pretty much comes with three pieces. We got the dragon sword, we got the base, and then we got the actual figure. Um, so the figure, if you're gonna, like, kind of compare it to a pop, it's a little bit, it's like half an inch taller than a pop. Um, so that's why I was saying I was a little disappointed with the actual price because without the base, it's really short. You know, I wanted it to be just a little bigger, but that's fine. Um, if I had to, if I was going to measure it, uh, without the base, let's see what we got. We got about a little over five inches. Mmm... Maybe you can give it 5.5 inches, maybe. Um, but it is short. As we know, pops are usually about 4 inches. So it's a little bit taller than that. Um, so I just want you guys to know. Because I fell in love with this thing. And you might still love it. You might be like, I don't give a damn how much it costs. It's a Green Ranger figure playing... The Dragon Zord. And you know what? I would definitely feel you. So I just put that together. Now he's playing the Dragon Zord. Man, if I knew the tune, boy, I would definitely be saying the tune right now. But I don't know it. Uh, so, but. Has a little peg there. You put it on the peg. And boom. There it is, baby. 
So, I mean, my hands are a little bit, you know, taller than it. So now that we have the base, let's see. I want to hold it right. With the base, we're looking at six and a half inches there. I know you guys can't see that, but six and a half inches. You can at least you can see how tall the ruler is compared to it. You know, so we got six and a half inches, guys. So that is the Fig Arts Zero Green Ranger. Easy to collect and cool style. I mean, I really do like the. It's it's probably too bright, but it it looks like. Like, it looks like he has a suit on. Like, really. Like, I do like what they did as far as, you know, the the colors. I do like... it's. This is way brighter. It's way brighter than what it really is. Well, there it goes. It's kind of coming to its own now. Uh, it looks like it has a suit. The, the, the sculpting was really nice on this. I love the helmet. It's pretty dope. Um, like, I, I mean... I don't, I don't regret it, but I like to get the bang for my buck, you know, and this is kind of small, six and a half inches for 60 bucks, you know, um, but hey, it's the only one like it, I've never seen anything like it, usually they come in like the little, um, action figures where you can, they're all posable and look real cheap, I want him to be a statue, and he's doing like the dopest thing ever, I don't know the, the actual tune, but, um, like, when the Green Ranger came out, that was the shit. And if you don't remember, if you don't remember what it was like when the Green Ranger came out, sorry for you. I loved it, and I actually liked the Green Ranger probably more than I liked the White Ranger, but I get it, he had to become a good guy, so whatever, got more powers, fine. But, Green Ranger... There's even the sword. The dragon sword's way better than the, the, the white ranger sword. But, hey, hey, whatever. I love the green ranger. It's going right in my display case there, right next to my uh, Hikari uh, Megazord. So, loving it. All right, guys, I'm your boy, DeAnthony. Hit me up. Please like, subscribe, share, and comment. Peace.